Preview. Preview. A deadly strain, and I mean a deadly strain of flu is, uh, is mutating to the point now of grave concern. This deadly strain of what they're calling mutated bird flu could kill up to 300 million people. Are you serious? 300 million. And that is, now I, I reported on this last year. I was at a conference last year in Florida at a Mensa conference and one of the uh, government employees from the uh, CDC uh, said that there's a global health concern about the rapid mutation of the uh, bird flu and that it's already started now where the bird flu is massive among chickens and turkeys and ducks and that kind of thing. But it started last year to jump from birds to humans, okay? Birds to humans, but not from human to human. Well, now this bird flu has mutated even more to the point now they're expecting a pandemic to break out once it starts to transfer from human to human. So birds to human and then human to human. And here's the deal. Top scientist and the chair of the uh, Global Health Council is warning that there could be a pandemic at any time now. And here's the problem. They have no vaccine. And no one's going to make any vaccines until this thing develops. Can't afford to make millions of vaccines for a disease that has yet to spread. And the shelf life's not long enough if they could. They don't have one. Uh, And they won't even try to develop one until, until this begins to happen. And that's why I'm warning you. That's why you need to... Read Psalms 91 and understand the divine protection you can have through Christ. And in these last days, folks, Jesus said there would be plagues or diseases or pestilences that would spread. And even when the two witnesses come, they will send plagues upon the earth as they will, as they will be persecuted by mankind for preaching of the coming of Jesus Christ, uh, the, the fact that People won't want to believe them. Well, this killer strain of flu could break out at any time and will claim whether they believe, and they said this last year, they're still saying this now, 300 million lives. This is the warning from one of the world's top health scientists following a winter plague by the so-called Aussie flu that, that was an outbreak of that in the United Kingdom. Dr. Jonathan Quick, chair of the Global Health Council, said that the flu virus is the most diabolical, hardest to control, and fastest spreading potential viral killer known to humankind. And we know that this year in America, it's been the worst flu outbreak since 1918. And a lot of people have died from it. Matter of fact, we just recently had uh, uh, a great guitar player in the Indianapolis area among the churches got the flu, got pneumonia, and died. Um, They're warning that if there was a global outbreak of this newly mutated strain, it could kill up to 300 million people. The winter flu outbreak was a warning that the world needs to be prepared for this new strain of bird flu, which is most likely to break out uh, very soon. Dr. Quick has warned that the the vital infrastructure, including hospitals and global economy, could all collapse under the pressure caused by a pandemic. Speaking uh, also to the media, Dr. Quick warned, the conditions are right. It could happen tomorrow. It seems that what's happened since 1918 with the Spanish flu, and then again in 1956 with the Asian flu, the most likely culprit will be the new unprecedented deadly mutation of the, of the flu virus, the conditions are right, it could happen. Uh, we're talking about, folks, specifically three strains of bird flu or avian flu known as H5N1, H7N9, and H5N6. These three mutated strains are the most highly susceptible to this jump 
from bird to human and then human to human. Matter of fact, of those three, the H5N1 poses the greatest threat of mutating and sparking the next killer pandemic worldwide. And so if a new highly contagious strain of the H5N1 were to evolve and hitch, hitchhike like an unwitted passenger onto the aeroplane, the pandemic situation would quickly assume disaster of a biblical proportions, okay? So we're talking about an apocalyptic situation. We're talking about, though, biblical prophecy, as Jesus said in Matthew 24, we would see these plagues come. And also, in the book of Revelation, chapter 11, we know in the end times, during the rise of the two witnesses, many plagues will come upon the earth and, uh, and strike mankind for their disobedience, of course, and, and disrespect for the two, uh, two prophets, the two witnesses that God sends upon the earth to prepare mankind for the coming of the Lord. So.